Hey everybody, NegroVMX here, part uh, 18 I believe, and uh, I'm back to where I was before. I did level up a bit. Lotus now level 17, Drew's 15, Lin's 11. Let's continue along. That sucked, man. Alright. Right, right at the end. Okay, here's the bottom floor. So let's do this thing, huh? Jesus fucking Christ. That just, that, I'm sorry, that just sucked. Okay, now, um, before I go through those barriers, because that's what I was concerned about, let me just see if and there's our treasure chests there, and they are not opened. So we'll see how much it takes. Uh -huh. It's pretty nasty. You basically just gotta keep healing yourself. I might meet enemies, so let's heal again. This is why I said you need two healers down here, really, because then there's getting out of here. And there's enemies, too. 151 gold. World map. That's excellent. Steel armor. Hmm. Is that better than what I have? Let me see something. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta, just, you know what I want to do? I want to get rid of some of this repellent. You know, while I was back in the town, I should have, uh, also, uh, sold the hammer. I just want to see if this steel armor is any good. I don't think so, but. It's, it's worse. Okay. So I'll just hang on to that. We'll sell it. And this is a strength seed. That's always worth having. Just gonna use that on Lodo right away. Actually, wait. I should be able to take two more steps without dying. Okay. Well, that wasn't too bad, actually. Alright, yeah, now no more damage. Alright, now heal more everybody. And we'll continue through here. And that, that'll be it for him casting heal more, so any more healing will have to be done by Lin. No more surprises, just a straight shot to where the Draco Lord's throne was. Oh, now he can't cast outside. That was stupid of me. I guess I'll have to walk back out. Should have had Lin do a little bit of the healing there. She doesn't have outside. These poison marshes aren't as bad as the uh, barrier floors. This is no enemies on this floor. I thought there would be. Good of you to come, Lodo. I am the great grandson of the King of Kings, Dracolord. I have heard some Hargon fancies himself to be something special and carries on as if he were so. I am not amused. If you agree to eliminate Hargon, I will tell you a secret. Well, well I'm already going to eliminate Hargon, so I'm going to say yes. Ah, you'll do it then. Good. Collect the five seals. That will give you the protection of an elemental spirit. There is a small island south of the town that was once known as Mercado. That is where you must first go. Without the five seals, and without the power of the elemental spirit, Hargon cannot be defeated. So not only has Dracolord's grandkid here told us what we need to do, like basically the second half of the game is all about collecting the five seals... But, he told us where the first one is. Although you don't have to get them in any particular order. Yeah. But, uh, let's get out of here. What level am I on again? Uh, I'm level 17, so I am actually uh, about prepared for going after the next seal, so... Man, I can't believe I... Well, he has five magic points. I hmm. was wrong on that, so let's just cast out... Oh, no, it costs six. All right. Oh, well. <laughs> eh. Sick of this place. So I level up a little. Here's a gremlin and a mummy man. Okay, now Mercado doesn't exist anymore. 
But if you know where Mercado was in the first game, you go south of there. It's very easy to find. So we're going to do that next. First, we want to visit a town. I'll probably Tantage up because it's close by. A Gorgon, a Gremlin, and two Saber Tigers. And now I know how dangerous these Gremlins can actually be with that breathing fire shit, so. Oh boy. Are you kidding me? I gotta heal him. Heal him already! Well, I don't need to there, but I'll do it right after. Okay. So who would have known that you go through Draco Lord's Castle, not only find Lodo's sword where it was in the first game, but you'd see somebody on the throne. Like, I gotta say, the first time I played through this game, I, uh, I got down there, I didn't know what to expect, and when I saw the guy sitting on the throne, the same sprite as in the first game, I'm like, it's a fucking Draco Lord, and I'm like, I healed myself up and prepared for a boss battle, and then the third surprise comes as you talk to him, and he's friendly, and he tells you what to do next. That's crazy. So Dracolord's grandson would be the great-grandson of the Dragon Queen. Learn about that more in uh, Dragon Quest Three. But um, he's an all-around okay guy. He's just content to sit in his grandfather's throne in a ruined castle. Now the, you know deep below a rune castle and just kind of hang out there. You know, it's a shame they never really did a sequel to this because Dragon Quest 3 is a prequel. And it would have been interesting to see, like, it continue past Dragon Quest 2 after you defeat, you know, Hargon and, and, you know, everything that comes after that. But, um... You know, it would have been interesting if they did, like, another game where, like, you know... Draco Lord's grandson is like he actually is a villain, and uh, he was just using you to get Hargon out of the way, because that's you know the competition. So, I don't know. I think that would have been kind of cool. Never happened though. Instead, we got a prequel, which was one of the most awesome games ever, Dragon Quest Three, and when they made Dragon Quest Four, which was even better than Dragon Quest One. Oh, I can't get there from here, can I? Well, actually, if I go around the island, I can. Then, you know, it was a completely new story. So, yeah. There we are. I want to stay at the inn here, sell some stuff, you know. Certainly sell that steel armor I found, as well as uh, the hammer that I bought earlier. I'm going to do that right now. Okay, so definitely sell that hammer. I get 3,000 gold for that. And the steel armor. Oh no, I'm done, I'm done, I'm, I'm done! I don't want it, I don't want it! Hit the wrong button, I hit A instead of B. Alright. Still don't have the gold key, so I can't talk to the king. But, Drekalord was actually more... <laughs> He was more useful. So let's uh, head to the next area. Which he says where Mercado was. Now, if you don't know where Mercado was, basically it was uh, right to the uh, the east of where I am right now. So we're basically just going to go south from here. Look at this, Jesus. Sorry. I have all this shit open I'm trying to close. Maps and whatnot that I don't need anymore. Oh, look at this. Yeah, I don't want to abuse the fast forward feature. I'd never use it, but when everybody's asleep like that, come on, really?
That is some shit. Damn! You know, it's not exactly exactly south for Mercado. It's like south and a little bit west, which is why it's actually perfect here. See? Here it is. It's a lighthouse. So let's go in there. Oh, let's talk to this guy, huh? I have no idea where you may have heard about them. But are you trying to find the five seals too? Yeah. Seals are not objects. They are markings of the soul. In your strength, they are engraved. That's what I was told. Don't ask me what that might mean, though. Well, I would imagine that uh, it means they don't go in your inventory? <laughs> I mean, that's what basically it means, that you don't have to worry about your inventory being all full and everything because you all, you know, they, they're on your soul or whatever, you know. So, um, all right, let's, 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 let's hit in on here. Let's go in here. All right, one second, guys. Sorry, just give me a minute here. Got a lot of shit open. All right, let's figure this place out. Oh, that's not the way. All right. I remember this place being a little rough with the uh, combat, but, yeah. Two saber tigers and a mummy man. As you can see, it is a lot of the same monsters that were in the Dracolord's castle, but there are some more powerful ones, so you gotta be uh, on the lookout for that. Okay, what do we got? Cloth armor? That's funny. It's, it, you know, the fact that the mummy character, they drop the cloth, you know, ha ha ha, I see what you did there, you know? It's a saber tiger, a gorgon, and an enchanter. They got that gorgon. Stop spell. Give me a fucking break. Basically one dungeon right after the other. Oh, which way am I going? I don't, I don't think I have a map for this place. Let me check. I don't think I have a map. Yeah, I don't. Ugh. Sorry, I'm talking to a co-worker at the same time. The reason these videos are up late is because of work. We had a meeting, you know. It's, it's a mess. I got a repellent. Exactly what I don't want. I think, okay, let's. I think you gotta get towards the center here. Uh, I guess that's not the way to do it. Backtrack. Yeah, I mean, that's the middle where I want to get. Hmm. Running out of time here, too. Yeah, this is the one part that I don't remember as well as the rest of the game. I don't know why. This lighthouse has always kind of been an irritating part for me. I know, it was up here. But you know what? I'm going to stop here. I'll see you guys next time. I'll figure it out then.